don't forget, while you're attending San Jack, you need to be aware of the college's payment deadlines and payment plan options. San Jack recently started a program called Pay As You Go or Pay Go, which sets payment deadlines for each semester. These deadlines are set prior to the start of classes and ensure that once you are registered in a course, you've secured a method to pay for it. That way, you can focus on your courses rather than worry about paying for school. Any course registration that isn't paid in full by the deadline is subject to withdrawal for non-payment. So, if you're receiving federal or state financial aid or scholarships, you must be certain that funds are authorized and will fully cover your tuition and fees by the payment deadline. If financial aid is not enough to cover tuition and fees in full by the payment deadline or has not completed processing all requirements, you can pay the additional amount out of pocket in full or set up an installment payment plan or IPP. This is a payment arrangement made with the business office directly or through your student SOS account. Keep in mind, an IPP is a payment agreement made between you and the school, regardless of financial aid availability. Once the payment deadline has passed, you may continue to register for courses prior to the first day of each individual course. All courses must be paid for in full or have an IPP agreement on file by the day of registration, if registration occurs after the payment deadline. If the course is not paid in full or an IPP agreement is not on record the day of registration, you are subject to course withdrawal for non-payment. If your financial aid process is complete after you have set up an IPP and you are eligible to receive an aid amount, that amount will post to your account. This may or may not be enough to cover your remaining balance. Contact financial aid if you have additional questions about aid after setting up an IPP.